begin another video with a 35 millimeter camera going out. <laughs> What's up everybody my name is Dalton aka the Florida Flipper and if you are new here I am a full-time reseller on eBay and Poshmark hopefully soon to be Amazon January 1st whenever you're seeing this video it is like December 5th of 2019 and yeah I'm a full-time reseller I buy stuff at yard sales estate sales thrift stores um, auctions pretty much anywhere I think I can find a deal for something cheap and flip it on the internet and I do that full time. It helps me uh, pay the bills, eat food, get cool stuff for my son. So yeah, if you enjoy that kind of stuff, you're in the right place for sure. So today I have 12 things going out on eBay. This is about, I would say, 39 hours of sale. I had a couple things sell this morning while I was selling at the flea market, which I wish I could get video of the flea market this morning, but I couldn't. Um, just, just no opportunity and the uh, four or five clips I did get got lost in the cloud. So unless someone out there knows how to like make that Apple cloud rain down my videos, then, um, yeah, I don't got any of those. I might have like one or two I'll throw in the end of this video, but yeah, let's get right into what I sold and you guys should definitely look out for some of this stuff. The first thing's going out is actually this Hawks games. There's Hawks and then a Hawks two. I got this in a giant Nintendo 64 um, bundle. I got a couple like I'd probably say a month and a half ago now. Um, yeah, I got maybe $3 into these two games and I sent an offer out to someone for $10 plus $4.59 shipping. So um, bread and butter, rice and beans item like normal. Another uh, video game I got going out today is Rock Band 2 for the Xbox 360. Minty fresh in here. I got $11.88 free shipping. And then I have one more video game, which um, I would say, if you guys are taking any advice from me recently, look for Star Wars stuff. Disney Plus just came out with a show, I guess, for Star Wars, as well as all the movies. So Star Wars stuff is getting hot again, real quick. So um, yeah, this is like an anniversary edition. This is uh, Star Wars Force Unleashed in one of those steel books. Um, nothing crazy here. Another eleven eighty eight free shipping sale. So um, yeah, Star Wars stuff be on the lookout so the next thing going out is actually something from one of my source videos again not a source buyer i don't believe no note left with it if you were a source buyer please comment on this video so i can like mention you in a future video but this is that pokemon city adventure um i think two days ago i started sending um offers like i do every three or four days i sent an offer of 22 dollars plus shipping on this and they took it so um, this is going out for 22 bucks Sorry if you're interested in my SARS video, but it's gone. All right, so typically when you watch YouTube videos, people like to put like their very best two or three items at the end. I'm actually showing them in the order they've sold. So the next one is actually something I found at a garage sale for $10. I didn't look it up while I was there, but I definitely had a hunch about it because there's a big cult following. This is a Matrix centennial new in the box figure i'll show you kind of what he looks like in there so if you see him not in the box um yeah i paid 10 bucks for this he was asking 25 i was like hey man i'll give you 10 bucks and i started to walk away and he sold it to me i got in the car i scanned the barcode that little fancy boy if you don't know you can do that you can do that directly in the ebay app you can scan that i scanned it and i'll put it right there for you to scan it if you like um yeah this bad boy it took a little bit, about two or three months to sell, but it sold for one twenty seven forty nine plus twenty seven eighty shipping to California. Um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna gonna be on the lookout for Matrix stuff. And if you guys see the Centennial thing out there in the wild, pick it up. All right, guys, I definitely didn't plan these sales on purpose. This is another thing to be on the lookout for. This is a Jurassic World figure. You see the JW right there. This is called like the Chomper or something. I picked this up at a garage sale. He was asking six bucks for it. I think I paid half of that, so three. Um, Jurassic World stuff, be on the lookout. I don't find much of it because down here there's a lot of niches. Like people are really into old vintage toys and like niche toys like these to sell on eBay. I kind of sell everything as you see. Um, yeah, but I picked up this up for three bucks and yeah, it sold for $20 plus 535 shipping. So um, Jurassic World, Jurassic Park, it sells. 
So I don't base a lot of my business on clothing. I actually started doing eBay directly for hard goods because I saw that flipping quicker on eBay when I looked at like soul comps when I was really studying hard. Um, but yeah, this is a clothing item that actually like I love nostalgic for sure. This is a vintage 1992 Nirvana t-shirt size medium. I am a medium, but it just doesn't fit me right. So, um, yeah, I put it up on eBay. I'll show you right there. There's that 1992 and it is not a reprint. I really looked into all of the vintage ones. This is an original 1992 Nirvana t-shirt. Um, and I had it up for a while and I was waiting and I was waiting and I had it for $39.99 free shipping. I threw a sale and it's gone. $35.99 for a vintage Nirvana, like a uh, smiley face logo t-shirt. So yeah, vintage band t-shirts, pick them up. I mean, they, I've got a whole bunch in my store. If you guys look at my store, I'm my, uh, my clothing, I got a lot of crazy stuff. I like to pick up stuff like this, but yeah. $1.25 into 36 bucks free shipping. Profit in probably 20 bucks. I'll take it. And again, another video with a 35 millimeter camera going out. <laughs> yeah, this one right here is a Ryko, just kind of like the other one. Not worth as much, but this is an FF3R. Um, is tested and working. I actually just got the film that I developed for this back. So if there's any issues, I have the film developed. By the way, what I do is when I take photos with the cameras, I actually take a picture of my phone. So I will like put up the screen and the date and the time. So when people know I'm taking a picture from here and I develop it of my 2020 iPhone, I think we'll be all right. All right. <laughs> so yeah, this one right here, be on the lookout for 35 millimeters, guys. $33.72 free shipping. Reason for the weird number, I threw a sale on. So I always pretty much hike my prices a little bit steeper than what they are in eBay's comps, and then I run a sale. Just kind of puts people on their, their toes, you know, gives them that eagerness to buy, or from what I've experienced in the, the seven or eight months since I've started. So yeah, 35 millimeter cameras. Buy them. Man, I feel like this video should just be like a bolo video. I have no idea. This is a pair of Hoka 1-1 running shoes. I picked these up at Goodwill for I think like $3.99 on um, one of those discount days that I went to last week for Black Friday. This is the Hoka 1-1 and I'll show you the tag. They are the Women's Clifton 5 Knit. I mean, these things are in great shape and which I heard Harry Tornado say one time, uh -huh, someone asked him how many miles run the shoe. Um, I don't know, but I did take a best offer on this and it sold within three or four days. Today is what, Thursday and Black Friday was a week ago. So yeah, I've, these have only been up since I think Saturday or Sunday, probably Sunday. And I took a best offer of $57.50 plus $10.50 shipping. So that's what, like a $48 profit? Yeah. Hoka 1-1 one, one running shoes. They're great. All right, item number 11. Another one to be on the lookout for and is awesome. First one I have found in the wild. It's a Furby, baby. <laughs> I remember these from when I was a kid and these things freaked me out. These were like the cuter gremlins, I guess, of my era. But yeah, this is a Furby. This is the tiger one. It says it right there there i'm gonna see if it can focus this time i don't know if it is because i can't see the screen but this is a furby tiger i had like eight or nine washers on this thing it's only been up for about two weeks tons of people send me offers on it and i was just waiting for the right buyer and they came around i got 35 dollars plus 10 40 shipping furbies if you see them with a box that or without a box this was actually like they still had the outer shell of the box but it was just beat to the bajumbos and I want to make sure it wasn't corroded. So I took it out of the box, checked the battery pack, threw some batteries, it works great. Gone, $35 per shipping. Furbies, they sell on eBay. So last thing going out, um, I just kind of want to get them to them quicker. This sold this morning at the flea market. And yeah, this is something that I should advise you doing if you have the opportunity. I bought this Nintendo 64 at that, um, you'll see the video, I think like seven or eight videos ago. It's a giant Nintendo 64 haul. It also says um, like games, Nintendo 64, as well as uh, Dreamcast. 
So I picked this up in the bundle. I paid like 180 for everything. Um, this puts me after I, this sale puts all the rest in the profit. This sold for $125 plus shipping, but no, it's not just the system. It's actually the system with three Nintendo branded controllers, blue, yellow, and black. And I bundled it also with three games and some decently desirable ones. Here's uh, Mario Kart 64, as well as GoldenEye 007 and Cruisin' USA. So, um, yeah, 125 plus 1047 shipping, and it's going to like Miami. So it's going to be a quick, quick little shipment. So, yeah, if you have the chance to bundle games and full consoles together, you can get more of a premium price. Um, I did have this steep. I had this up for like 150 but I did that on purpose to grab some watchers. And as soon as I put it on sale, it'd probably sell. And as soon as I put this bad boy on sale, it's gone. So it's going out. So, um, yeah, Nintendo retro games. I don't really have to tell you guys that I'm sure you know it. Older stuff that is not made anymore is typically good to pick up. All right, guys, all in all, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, hopefully you find some of this stuff, some good bolos there, like that Hoka 1-1 shoes, that Matrix thing, the Jurassic World, um, Star Wars. I told you about the Star Wars, Furbies. I mean, yeah, this was definitely, I think, a good video for me to wait to make for you guys to see what's selling. I mean, for good prices, too. So, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And also, I will link my eBay and Poshmark name right there, like I always do, as well as my Instagram, which that's at the underscore floor flipper. And yeah, if you want to contact me, Instagram's easiest. Um, eBay store is always up. I'll put it in the link as well. And thank you guys for watching. And hopefully, you can find some of this stuff out in the wild. I'm also going to attach the um, little clip I have left over from the flea market today, as well as some shipping. So if you guys enjoy that, stick along. And if you don't, then I'll see you guys later. And smash that like button on the way out and subscribe for more. Peace, guys.